Hey guys, Jack Parr from the Jack Parr Show. If you like our videos, be sure to subscribe to our channel below. We're coming at you today with a new segment on how to create a portable sound booth for recording voiceovers. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. From that magical place called Hollywood, it's the Jack Parr Show. Starring Jack Parr. Join us weekly for tips and tricks on filmmaking as well as reviews on cool camera gear. Also, we will be doing interviews with special guests like Billy Bob Thornton, Vern Troyer, Louie Anderson, and the Jack Parr Show Band. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Jack. Hey guys, welcome back. My name's Jack Parr. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a portable sound booth and the whole project takes about two minutes. It is so important when capturing audio, either voiceover or in front of camera, to have great audio. This project is going to cost you about $20 for the acoustic panels. Amazing. And uh, microphones start at about $40 and they can range all the way up to over $1,000. But what I'm gonna show you is a snowball mic made by Blue, and you can purchase this one for about $40, and it sounds great. It does really good job at capturing voiceover. Here's what you're gonna need for the project. You're gonna need three two foot by two foot acoustic panels. I paid $5 per panel. A roll of two inch gaff tape, and of course you're gonna need a good microphone. The one we're using today is the Blue Snowball mic, which delivers real decent audio for voiceovers. This microphone costs about 40 bucks. I'm doing mine on a smaller scale. As you can see, I'm using like 12 by 12 panels. Like I said, I recommend two foot by two foot panels. So, and this is the construction we're going for. First step is to tape the panels together, okay? So I leave about a one inch gap. I take my gaff tape, make sure the panels are lined up, and boom. We're gonna do the same with the next panel. I have my tape pre-cut, pre so it kind of makes it easier when you're assembling it. But here we go. So another one inch gap, and boom. There you got your portable sound booth, okay? Put your microphone in the center, and there you have it. Uh, a perfect sound booth, portable sound booth, for all about 15 bucks. Uh, this microphone right here that you see is $40 for the mic, and it comes with a portable stand, not quite like I have here, but it comes with a decent stand um, and you can also get a swing arm stand, uh, which I'll show you in a link below, um, all for about 80 bucks with the microphone. Everything you need for this project is listed below in our parts list. You can purchase everything for this project on Amazon. If you have any questions regarding any of our projects, feel free to comment below and we'll answer your question right away. I've been in situations on the road where you need to record great audio for a commercial, uh, wild lines, et cetera. And a portable sound booth like I just showed you works perfect. Once you do build your sound booth, it is important to find a quiet place in your home or office where you can set it up and leave it there permanently for recording audio. Make sure it's away from fan noises, any outside noises or ambient noises, so you can capture perfect audio. Also, if you're interested in doing professional voiceovers, you can start by going to a website called voice123.com. We use it all the time for commercials and voiceover stuff for films. It's a great way to get started. You go on, create a demo, which I'll show you in other videos, how to create a voiceover demo. Uh, but voice123.com 
is a great way to start your career as a voiceover artist. Hey guys, if you like this video, be sure to subscribe below and like our video. You can also check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and jackparshow.com. Have a great day and see you back here next time on The Jack Parr Show.